things. We learn that the idea of giving isn't like, here, you know, just take everything I have to everybody. You know, some give it, we learn that, you know, sometimes, sometimes giving is giving, but sometimes, you know, saying no is giving. <laughs> right? Sometimes, uh, sometimes receiving is giving. Sometimes giving is not giving. Sometimes giving is, is taking. The, um, it's, um, the idea, as I'm understanding it, is that every moment is, um, there's, a, there's a higher calling for what we can do in each moment. And uh, our physical nature is in each moment to think, like, to make our action based on what, what's going to be the best for me in that moment. We want to reach the place where we're making our decisions on each moment what to do from like a higher place. To try to get beyond our own self-interest and thinks what, what, what action can I do in this moment that's, that's, that, that's being called for from the higher place. So um, the place of truly caring for the other and giving doesn't mean just here, you know, take everything I have. Right. You know, take everything I have, so then how am I going to, you know, going to pay for my family's dinner tonight? Right. Right? So, uh, as far as, uh, you know, with, with uh, being surrounded by enemies and things like this, so, so we, learn, we learn in the Kabbalah that everything in our outer physical reality is actually an expression of our inner spiritual reality. And uh, we learn that as, a, as, a, as, as we're transforming on an individual level towards, towards truly caring for the other, we learn that that radiates to, to all the levels, and also the, you know, the sociological levels and the political levels. And of course, a person needs it. We need, like, we need today to have an army to protect ourselves and things like that. But we, we learned that the armies are not the solution. Obviously, you know, the transformation of consciousness is a is a solution.